Hello guys, today I wanted to show you how I make my three ingredient, four ingredient, however many ingredient you want to make, homemade seasoned salt. This is my great grandma's, isn't that cute? My great grandma's salt shaker, so I like using it every day. This recipe is in our Dining on a Dime cookbook, volume one, on page 393. You can vary the ingredients to whatever your family likes. I keep my salt shaker on the stove. So what I do is I put a few grains of rice in here to keep it from clumping. This is super easy. All you do is take salt. Now you can measure this out and then use a funnel and pour this into your salt shaker if you want after it's mixed. But I have done this for 25 years, so I just estimate because I just know that I do about a half salt and about, oh, an eighth garlic powder and an eighth onion powder and a sprinkle of pepper and a sprinkle of paprika and then fill with salt. All right, so I got my garlic powder and my onion powder. I find the cheapest ones are at Walmart. Just these little ones here, they're a dollar at Walmart. Then we don't really like paprika a lot, so I just do a light sprinkle of paprika and then a light sprinkle of pepper. And then I fill the rest with salt. And then we just shake. This seasoned salt I use every single day for my cooking. This way I don't have to pull out garlic and onion and salt and pepper all separately. It's all there together and I just pick up one shaker and it's super easy, super quick. And it's all mixed together and I can save myself a lot of steps. This is your homemade seasoned salt. Please visit us at livingonadime.com. The recipe is in the description below.